What's up, YouTube? Uh, it's today I got a, a much different kind of TCG opening. Um, this time it's Card Fight, Card Fight Vanguard because uh, I'm a big fan of the anime. I've never actually owned cards. These are probably the first set of cards I ever actually owned. Um, and uh, always a fan of the anime. Uh, I do watch their actual tournaments like whenever they have like a uh, a YouTube turn like a YouTube video tournament or something like that where it's recorded or streamed one or the other uh, so uh, I these are the first set of uh, card fight cards card fight Vanguard cards that I've ever actually owned so uh, this will be interesting and uh, I chose Shadow Paladin because uh, Shadow Paladin, the way it plays, uh, the characters that use it, they're all pretty cool. Uh, I know that it's a pretty popular deck, as far as I know. Uh, if I ever find an opponent that will play it, who would, you know, join me in our band card. So, uh, let's see. So I'm so excited because... Uh, Never actually owned Vanguard cards before, so this is the first set, and I plan on probably making uh, decks of it and buying booster boxes because they're cheaper than Yu-Gi-Oh cards, of course. So uh, I'm gonna look at here. Uh, I'm definitely gonna read this because I don't know anything really about it other than what the anime told me about. So because I know there's like terms I'm supposed to use, to learn like in magic so uh, yeah so that's the uh, first guide rule book uh, this is a play mat like the, the actual play mat see uh, and this is in the this uh, era of card fight is in the reboot to where it kinda goes back to their roots none of this uh, dry, stride generation stride stuff uh, yet but uh, also, uh, I got a, a little mat here. Uh, it's the Shadow Paladin one. Uh, I think it's it's from the Dusk of Requiem, or no, the Requiem at Dusk sneak preview mat. So uh, Blaster Dark, I believe, and then uh, Blaster Dark Dragon or something like that. I don't, I don't, I don't know for sure. So. Uh, uh, let's open this up. I don't know the rarities. I'm gonna learn them, but I'm gonna learn as I go. So, uh, Blaster Dark, one of my favorite cards in the game, from the animes at least. Uh, he is always cool. I always like his ability and all that stuff, where he pretty much just says, "Hey, you're uh, you're dead." So, and then we got alternate arts of it. Three of the. Three of the one card art and then uh, alternate art of another. So uh, that's cool. Four Blaster Darks. <clears throat> definitely a card I would, uh, definitely a, a card I would base a deck on. Uh, we got three Dark Dictators with the Force Gift. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's they, they have a new mechanic with the Force stuff. Uh, we got another one with it, Pulverizing Knight Damon. Got four of those guys. Uh, we got Witch of Calamity Emmer. We got three of them. Here, these are grade twos. Uh, probably gonna run out of room quick. Blaster Axe. Um, another cool one. Probably the coolest looking axe user I've seen in a long time. Got four of them. Uh, we got three fold bow, grade one. Uh, we got three blaster javelins. That's pretty cool. Blaster javelin. I think his original art looked a little bit better, but that's just me. Uh, we got knight of resistance limris, which is a perfect guard sentinel. So that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see if I can get a closer shot. Yeah, his shield is pretty cool looking. Uh, I'll just start stacking them on top. We got 
grade ones of which of Nostrum, a Aaron Rod, or Rod, probably Aaron Rod, based on the spelling. So uh, yeah, that's uh, cool. Uh, we got full bow. Uh, I believe this is the starter because uh, it's a grade zero with no trigger on it. So I'm guessing this is a starter. So, and here we got the triggers for our crit triggers. We got dark side trumpeteer or trumpeter, whatever. So that's cool. Uh, another set of uh, critical triggers. Uh, Death Feather Eagle. So he looks pretty pretty cool. I like the coloring on this one and the city setting. Uh, for our draw triggers, we have Howl Owl, which uh, I did question this because uh, it's like for the V series, they took out his ability, which is weird. I don't know if anybody else noticed that, but uh, he has no ability in the V series. So that's interesting. And for our heal triggers, we got Abyss Healer. She looks pretty cute. I like the design of her. And uh, she has a 20,000 shield. That's impressive. So, those are the triggers. Uh, we have a hollow, an, another uh, upper rarity of uh, Dark Dictator, which is starting to be my favorite card for the V series. And we got a hollow version of Blaster Javelin, which is pretty cool as well. Probably one of my, he's probably up there as far as favorites go, probably up my top 20 or so. So, and then we got these gifts, which is a new mechanic. It's been, uh, when you when you ride the, uh, units with the, the little marker on it, uh, right in that corner. Probably a bad idea to use the hollow version. Let's try to use a common version real quick. Uh, well. Camera's gonna stay blurry, but uh, yeah, there's a force gift uh, uh, little marker right there, and it pretty much says that you can use this. Which uh, force pretty much gives you extra power, protect gives you an extra guard, and uh, excel gives you an extra uh, uh, summoning circle, which is pretty cool. So we got two of the regular force ones, and then we got a blaster dark art imaginary gift. So that's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, that's. Uh, I really want to get into this. I'll most likely buy like booster boxes of card fight vanguard for most of this channel now, because I'm not going to buy any more booster boxes from Yu-Gi-Oh, because it's way too expensive. But uh, yeah, I'm going to probably uh, learn the game a little bit, um, probably build extra, more decks, probably build more than one Shadow Paladin, since Shadow Paladins are my favorite as far as like what I've seen in the anime and all that stuff. And all their arts are pretty cool as well. I may expand onto other decks as well. So uh, that's it for this video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, uh, hit a like. Feel free to subscribe. I do a bunch of openings for TCG and uh, compilation videos, so be sure to check those out. And uh, I'll see you in the next video.